Professor Rajendra Prasad, Director Medical Education and Emeritus Professor, Department of Respiratory Medicine, Eras Lucknow Medical College, Lucknow. I have been former director, Vallabhai Patel Chess Institute, Delhi, former director, Institute of Medical Sciences, Safai, now it is Medical University, and former professor and head department of pulmonary medicine in King George Medical University. Today is 15th November 23. It is celebrated as World COPD Day throughout the world. On the occasion of this World COPD Day, I would like to say that COPD is very common disease globally as well as in India. It is estimated that about 30 crore people they are suffering from COPD globally and India around 5.5 crore people they are suffering from COPD. It is causing death also. About 32 lakh people die every year with COPD globally. About 8.5 lakh COPD patients die of COPD in India. As far as state of Uttar Pradesh is concerned, UP is having out of total 5.5 crores, UP is having the largest number about 90 lakhs, about literally about 1 million. And out of 8.4 lakh deaths, about 2 lakh deaths occur in UP, that is again largest in number. So disease, and if you see what are the causes, mainly it is a human made disease. When I say this, smoking is one of the cause. Then atmospheric pollution outdoor as well as indoor is another cause. These are two major causes. So we can all prevent both and you have to detect if you have any symptom, if you are smoking and if you develop any symptom, you must go to the hospital, doctors, check yourself, check your lungs whether you have COPD or not. As I said, this is a progressive disease. So prevention is very important. And prevention, I have already told that if smoking is one of the major cause and other is atmospheric pollution. So we can prevent it. Now another last point I would like to say, people fear of tuberculosis. But it is much more than tuberculosis. Tuberculosis is a curable disease. COPD is a progressive disease. Hardly there is any cure. So if you see the latest statistics of COPD and tuberculosis in India, about 55 lakh people estimated to have COPD. And the latest figure what came out about two days back, WHO 23 Global TV report, it says about 28, 29 lakhs of TB in India. So it is just more than double. Death wise also, hardly about 3.5 to 4 lakh people die with tuberculosis. Usually nobody should die of tuberculosis, I used to say. But from COPD, more, more than double, 8.5 lakh people die with COPD. So what I am trying to say that it is a very common disease, it is a dreaded disease and if and but at the same time I say that it can be prevented. Most of the things can be prevented so that development of COPD and progression can be halted. And to halt the progression, the mantra I used to say that early detection is very important. Usually in the early stage COPD patients have no complaint. So what I say that if you are a smoker 
and you get yourself lungs checked and after age of 40, 45 like you check your heart. So, you check your lungs and very simple test by history by x-ray and by spirometry we can very immediately tell whether anybody is suffering from COPD or not. So, for early detection is the key is the mantra I always say. So, what I can say in the end on this very particular day that COPD is a preventable, preventable disease, large number of people are affected by it in, in terms of morbidity and mortality. And last thing what I wanted to say, you can prevent it. Another point, you know, if you see the western figures, COPD most of the 80 to 90 percent of the COPD is because of the smoking. But in India, various researches done, they say that COPD is just, smoking is just in 50 percent. 50 per, it means in another half of the COPD patients, there are other factors. And I have already told you, pollution could be one. And there are many other factors, old tuberculosis, old asthma. So, in the end, what would like to say that COPD is a dreaded disease large number of people are affected by it, large number of death is also occurring. And although the treatment is there in which you can give you some support, can give you improve the quality of life, but it is a progressive disease and so prevention is a key mantra when COPD, we talk about COPD. Thank you very much.